Well, when and who knows if the NFL season starts, there will be player protests during the national anthem. Will head coach Doug Peterson support those players who take part? Also, the Eagles suffer a huge loss on the offensive line. Pat Gallen has sports. For the Eagles, it's been an off-season unlike any other. COVID-19 has kept them apart, but the recent protests highlighting social injustice has been a major focus for the team. Head coach Doug Peterson discussed how he's attempting to lead and learn. Just understanding that, and this is what I told you know my, my team uh, several weeks ago, a couple weeks ago when we had a team meeting. Is you know I, I want to learn, I want to understand. I, you know, I, I came from you know, a world that, that, that didn't, didn't understand that. And, and so for me, uh, as, an, as, a, as an adult, I want to be able to also be able to take the information and teach my own boys. When asked if he would join his team for pregame demonstrations, Peterson responded that he wants to talk with his players face to face first. Uh, nothing has been determined. I, I understand that, you know, that, that players, um, and I support players who, who demonstrate peacefully and uh, you know stand stand for something because you know it's part of the it's part of we we have to we have to fix the whys it's part of the whys that and, and trying to understand um, you know our players and we support our players I support our players and uh, but we're going to have these conversations I, I know once we uh, once we get into camp. Another wrench was thrown into the Eagles offseason. All-pro guard Brandon Brooks was lost for the season with a second ruptured Achilles. Gosh, my, my heart sunk uh, when I got the news uh, about Brandon's injury. Um, this guy has worked extremely hard to, to get himself back and back in shape, back in playing shape to, to have a, a solid 2020 season. We're going to take a look at a lot of different scenarios, a different, different possibilities, and um, you know we've got some time before uh, training camp to try to sort these things out. So, you know, at this time, we're just we're just feeling for Brandon and, and uh, want to make sure everything goes smoothly with, uh, you know, with him and, and, and get him get him back on track for the future. When the Eagles do return to practice, Peterson said they will likely be utilizing multiple locations for socially distanced practices, including Lincoln Financial Field. Their training camp is slated to begin in late July as it stands today. I'm Pat Gallen, CBS 3 Eyewitness Sports.